It'll hold. We're not gonna make it. We'll make it. Pull up! Pull up! You did that on purpose, didn't you? We need to get to the bridge. From there, we can use the captain's neural implants to initiate an overload of the ship's fusion engines. The explosion should damage enough systems below it to destroy the ring. Bridge. Let's get to work. Upload me into the control systems. The terminal is located next to the main view screen. I leave home for a few days and look what happens. This won't take long. There. That should give us enough time to make it to a lifeboat and put some distance between ourselves and Halo before the detonation. I'm afraid that's out of the question, really. Oh, hell. Ridiculous! That you would imbue a warship's AI with such a wealth of knowledge? Weren't you worried it might be captured? Or destroyed? He's in my data arrays, a local tap. You can't imagine how exciting this is! To have a record of all of our lost time! Human history, is it? Fascinating. Oh, how I will enjoy every moment of its categorization! To think that you would destroy this installation, as well as this record! I am shocked. Almost too shocked for words. He stopped the self-destruct sequence. Why do you continue to fight us, Reclaimer? You cannot win! Give us the construct, and I will endeavor to make your death relatively painless and- At least I still have control over the comm channels. Where is he? I'm detecting taps throughout the ship. Sentinels, most likely. As for the monitor... He's in engineering. He must be trying to take the core offline. Even if I could get the countdown restarted... I don't know what to do. How much firepower would you need to crack one of the engine's shields? Not much. A well-placed grenade, perhaps, but why... Okay, I'm coming with you. Chief! Sentinels!
The ship was heavily damaged when it crashed. Head to the cryo chamber. We should be able to get to the engine room through there. Engine room located. We're here. Alert! The monitor has disabled all command access. We can't restart the countdown. The only remaining option is to detonate the ship's fusion reactors. That should do enough damage to destroy Halo. Don't worry, I have access to all of the reactor schematics and procedures. I'll walk you through it. 
First, we need to pull back the exhaust couplings. That will expose a shaft that leads to the primary fusion drive core. this installation as well as this fascinating record. Good! Step one complete. We have a straight shot into the fusion reactor. We need a catalyst explosion to destabilize the magnetic containment field surrounding the fusion. Use an explosive. I recommend a grenade or rocket. If you run out of explosives, there is an armory station located near the engine room's entrance. Fusion reactor number one destabilizing. Use explosives on the other three reactors. That should be enough to trigger a wildcat explosion of the engines.
Engine room located. We're here. Alert! The monitor has disabled all command access. We can't restart the countdown. The only remaining option is to detonate the ship's fusion reactors. That should do enough damage to destroy Halo. Don't worry, I have access to all of the reactor schematics and procedures. I'll walk you through it. First, we need to pull back the exhaust couplings. That will expose a shaft that leads to the primary fusion drive core. Good! Step one complete! We have a straight shot into the fusion reactor. We need a catalyst explosion to destabilize the magnetic containment field surrounding the fusion cells. Use an explosive. I recommend a grenade or rocket. If you run out of explosives, there is an armory station located near the engine room's entrance. Analyzing. Fusion reactor. Engine room located. We're here. Alert! The monitor has disabled all command access. We can't restart the countdown. The only remaining option is to detonate the ship's fusion reactors. That should do enough damage to destroy Halo. Don't worry, I have access to all of the reactor schematics and procedures. I'll walk you through it. First, we need to pull back the exhaust couplings. That will expose a shaft that leads to the primary fusion drive core. We need a catalyst explosion to destabilize the magnetic containment field surrounding the fusion cells. Use an explosive. I recommend a grenade or rocket. If you run out of explosives, there is an armory station located near the engine room's entrance. Analyzing. Fusion reactor number one destabilizing. Use explosives on the other three reactors. That should be enough to trigger a wildcat explosion of the engines.
protocols continuing. it up. Only one more fusion reactor to go. gone critical. Based on the current rate of decay, we should have 15 minutes to get off the ship. We don't have much time. We should move outside and signal for evac. Accessing schematics. There's a service lift at the top of the engine room. It leads to a class 7 service corridor that runs along the ship's dorsal structure. Hurry! Inconsistent.
Ridge at 555. The Pillar of Autumn's engines are going critical, Fohammer. Request immediate extraction. Approach the crash site and be ready to pick us up at external access junction 4C as soon as you get my signal. Affirmative. Echo 419 going on station. Echo 419 to Cortana. Things are getting noisy down there. Everything okay? Negative, negative. We have a wildcat destabilization of the ship's fusion core. The engines must have sustained more damage than we thought. Analyzing. We have six minutes before the fusion drives detonate. We need to evac now! Activating final countdown timer. When it reaches zero, the engines will detonate. The explosion will generate a temperature of almost 100 million degrees. Don't be here when it blows. We can't make it on foot. We need a vehicle. Negative, negative. We have a wildcat destabilization of the ship's fusion core. The engines must have sustained more damage than we thought. Analyzing. We have six minutes before the fusion drives detonate. We need to evac now! Activating final countdown timer. When it reaches zero, the engines will detonate. The explosion will generate a temperature of almost 100 million degrees. Don't be here when it blows. We have six minutes before the fusion drives detonate. We need to evac now! Activating final countdown timer. When it reaches zero, the engines will detonate. The explosion will generate a temperature of almost 100 million degrees. Don't be here when it blows.
Wait, stop! This is where Fohammer is coming to pick us up. Hold position here. Cortana to Echo 419. Two Covenant Banshees are approaching on your six. Evade! Say again, evade! I'm Calculating alternate escape route. Ship's inventory shows one longsword fighter is still docked in Launch Bay 7. If we move now, we can make it. Cutting it close! Here we go. make it scanning just dust and echoes we're all that's left we did what we had to do for earth an entire covenant armada obliterated and the flood we had no choice halo it's finished no i think we're just getting started 